guys and gals. First find other than uh, shotgun shells is a buckle of some sort. There you go. I don't know if it really has any age on it or what. I'm whew, trying to catch my breath. Um, I'm at a uh, mid to late 1800s location that a dwelling used to be here. So who knows? It still moves, so it's not really rusted up. Alrighty, good find. Time for me to catch my breath. Here's my hole that I had the uh, buckle. And over here, I'm getting an 8081, which is uh, what the buckle was ringing up in. Not too deep, a couple inches maybe. What? Look at that. That's two. Somebody lost their uh, overalls or something up here. All right. Ah. Huh. Let me see here. It looks like a exact match. The other one. Uh-huh, yeah, look about the same, sort of, yeah, I'd say they're the same, on to the next. Probably junk, oh look, what is this? This is uh, rub it on the pants a little here. Oh. What is this? Don't know. Probably nothing. Five seventy-six. We'll throw that in our bag and move right along. I'm getting another eighty, eighty-one. Sound like another buckle. I'm still in that area where I found the last two. Seems to be a. A lot of stuff in here. A petrified bug. Yeah, that's it we got here. being here oh I see something roundness yeah that's all it is 
type of a washer, I suppose. Let's move on. I probably wasted a good hour. I was messing around the woods elsewhere in a new location on the way to this spot. And nothing but shotgun shells. And, um, so we ended up here. I know I'll find stuff here. Alrighty. Good seeing you all again. And I'm going to get a drink of water and head back to it. Rad. Uh, I need to get into shape. Long winter for me. Alrighty. 86 to 88 here. Could be anything at this place. up a little. Oh. oh! Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah, buddy. Yeah. Oh yeah, I remember that. Can't uh, think of the name offhand. That's an old one. Oh look. Darn thing turns. In fact, they put the screw, the lid on improperly. Ugh. Ugh. All right, I'll take that. Very nice. Yeah, all righty, on to the next. Now, yeah, got some kind of a I don't know what this is, but there you go. Possibly brass. Look at this I ran into. Is this a big lamp? The backing of a lamp, uh, like maybe for a tractor? You know, the house and the bulb would have been in here. It does have a hole in the center. Something here. This little hanger. Yeah, I can picture this on being mounted like this. Uh, I can't even see what the hell I'm pointing at, so. Anyway, neat find. I'll have to leave it here, though. On to the next. Okay. Nice big old root here. Got my first coin. Not sure, I guess it's a penny.
pretty crusty. It's on one side. Let me see if I can clean it up here a second. Well, it's a uh, wheat scent. And uh, the date, maybe you all can see. Let me get this here. Anyway, it's hard for me to hold still. Here you go, our first week on this site. Alrighty, on to the next. All right, I got something else in the 80, 81 range. Maybe we got another penny. Who's that? Is that it? Okay, uh, <laughs> man. Oh, it's a rivet and it's got cloth or something in it in between it, I guess. Yeah. On to the next. Hope the wind's not too bad. Got an 80, 81 here also. Huh. Another buckle. Is that the third one we found? Boy, they're losing their buckles up here on this mountaintop. I don't think that's old. So, probably from the last people that lived here, which was, I guess, 79, something like that is when the house disappeared. Something like that. On the next. For the fun of it, I'm gonna live dig this. I got something big in here. And I picture it being a uh, farm implement, implement or something. Very high signal, but uh, I was wrong. Big hunk of brass, looks like copper. There's something down there. Look at this soil. My goodness, is this nice. Mm. Good lord. Big old nail. Regular nail though. Alrighty. On the next. Another one. I've been finding uh, several of these mason jar lids. A couple of them were cracked. A couple of them came out like this, still intact. You know I like collecting these. So anyway, uh, I'll just keep moving on. Alrighty, here you go. On to the next. Oh, I got this. Might have come off of some tractor. Uh, 
start saying what this is. But there you go. I'm gonna have to head on back to the car. I got about a, I don't know, 45 minute walk from here in some thick woods. I don't want to get stuck out here in the dark. Alrighty, on to the next. Alrighty, I think this is my last. Got something in the... Uh, little shotgun shell. Now it just pulled me up this. Looks like a part to a plow. I guess parts of this big parts of this was farmland at one time already ah oh, this poor tree wasn't that long ago she was standing wow This is a really nice tree. Sad to see it go. It's a big one. It was. Alrighty. Headed back. Time to go in the woods. There's the woods line. Wood line. And we're off. Alrighty everybody, it's time for me to head on home. I'm getting a little dark out here. I changed my color a little on this camera. I had it on the wrong setting again until the last one or two digs. But anyway, thanks for coming along. We had a very good time. The weather's beautiful out here. I could be in shorts right now. But uh Nah, I don't think so. So anyway, with that, appreciate you all coming along. Um, wishing the best to all of you. Appreciate everybody's support, all of my uh, subscribers. And uh, when and if you're out there digging, don't forget to cover up your holes. Leave it like you were never there. And with that, I got to go down this hill. Boy, I tell you, I gotta get some food in me. I got a couple of granola bars. Maybe I'll chow down on that. But I got a ways to go to my car. So anyway, y'all take care. Thanks for coming along. <laughs>